This video shows how to troubleshoot your notebook using Windows 8 when it starts but the screen remains blank. Follow these steps if your notebook computer turns on but the screen remains blank. A hard reset can resolve many issues that cause a blank screen. First, press the power button to turn off the notebook. Disconnect all devices from the notebook. Remove any USB devices and media cards. Disconnect the AC power adapter and remove the battery. Press and hold the power button for at least 15 seconds. Reconnect the AC adapter, but do not connect the battery. Press the power button to turn on the notebook. If the screen turns on, the issue is resolved. If the screen is still blank, continue to the next step. The screen might remain blank if there is a problem with the LCD display. Test the display by connecting an external monitor. If you are having trouble viewing the external monitor, press the F4 key to switch between the screens. If an image displays on the external monitor, there might be a graphics driver conflict with the notebook's LCD display. With the external monitor connected, Go to support.hp.com and click on the Software and Drivers tab to download and install the latest drivers for your computer. If the screen is still blank, continue to the next step. Many HP notebooks have an emergency BIOS recovery feature that allows you to recover and install the last known good version of the BIOS from the hard drive. Follow these steps to recover an earlier version of the BIOS. You will not be able to see anything on the monitor. Press the power button to turn off the notebook. Plug the notebook into a power source using the AC power adapter. Press and hold the Windows key and the B key at the same time while the notebook is off. While pressing the Windows and B keys, hold down the power button for one second, then release the power button and the keys. The power LED light remains on, and the screen remains blank for about 40 seconds. The BIOS update begins. If the screen is still blank, continue to the next step. Removing and replacing the memory modules might resolve blank screen issues. Follow these steps to remove the module, then place it back in the memory slot. Open your internet browser and go to support.hp.com. Type your model number and replace memory into the HP support page search field to find steps specific for your computer model. Follow these steps to drain all the power from the notebook to prevent accidental damage to the electrical components. Turn off the notebook by pressing and holding the power button for 30 seconds. Unplug the AC adapter from the notebook. Slide and hold the battery release latch to unlock the battery. Lift the battery out. Loosen the screws on the memory compartment cover then lift up and remove it. Pull the retention clips away from the sides of the memory module, then pull the module out of the slot. Do not touch the metal contacts. To prevent damage to the memory module, grasp the memory modules from the edges. Hold the memory module at a 45 degree angle and align the notched edge of the module with the tab in the slot. 
Firmly press the module into the slot. Pivot the top edge of the memory module downward until the retention clips snap into place. Then place the cover over the memory compartment and tighten the screws. Plug the AC adapter back into the notebook. Then connect the AC adapter to a working power supply. While the computer is off, place the battery into the base enclosure and press until the retention clips click into position. Power on your notebook and check to see if Windows loads. If the computer fails to boot to the Windows desktop after trying all steps, contact HP to find out your support options. Your options for service might vary depending on how long you have owned the computer and what country you live in. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com forward slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash how to for you.